Okay, this is a clone of the old GM ST125 ignition spark tester. This is by Performance Tool. And this requires, according to this 1984 Camaro shop manual, it says a minimum of 25,000 volts to fire. So this is basically a fake spark plug. It's got a big gap on here. It's got to go through the nose cone around to fire. So this it's got to have a HEI system with a lot of uh, up to speed where it's going to go ahead and have a large spark, a lot of uh, capacity. Um, again, this is a Harbor Freight one here, 69014. This will fire at a lower voltage. So if it fires with this, you may have an engine that runs, and then you need to use this if you want to check it like it's actually under load uh, with a higher condition. This actually would check the system better on an HEI system. Now here's an adjustable tester. It goes from 0 to 40 kilovolts. Number 404. Textron. And it's got an adjustable gap down in here. And in the back it tells you uh, for lawnmowers you set it to SE, which is down here probably about 10. Conventional spark 0.7 to 20. Then it tells you the different Ford and GM. GM HEI says 30 to 34. Here's some Chryslers. So this is adjustable. Close the closer the gap is, the higher the shorter the voltage. The wider the gap, the higher the voltage to fire. This is 25 kilovolts. And then this is a Harbor Freight one, which will fire at a fairly low voltage. So you can have a system that is kind of marginal. It'll show spark, but it may end up uh, goofing up under load. And that's why one of these on a GM is better to use because it fires at a higher voltage or one of these adjustable ones.